Let's open Microsoft Word real quick. We're going to use a new blank document. Now this is your ribbon and if you're not sure what your ribbon is, I'll link a link in the comment section down below. Well, I should say the description box down below. You can click on that video to totally find out what exactly or where exactly your ribbon is. So this is our title bar, this blue strip at the extreme top of our Microsoft Word window. And where we have our customized quick access toolbar will come right beside it where there's this little down pointing arrow and this finger which points into a circle. We'll click that and we'll use the drop down menu to look at two options here. So we have mouse mode which i am already in and basically touch mode is for people or are for people who have touch screens like myself i'm using a computer that has both touch screen and i can use my mouse so let's click touch screen and immediately you'll see your ribbon here the icons transformed before your eyes they got a bit more spaced out bigger which helps you to touch those things with your finger if you decide to use your screen instead of using your mouse or mouse pad now we'll go back to that menu here and we'll change it back to mouse and if you notice the icons get smaller so when the icons get smaller of course you know you'll be able to use your mouse pointer to select the different options in your ribbon but when you go to touch mode it gets a bit bigger where you could use your finger and i'll show you exactly what i mean right now now we're still in touch mode and i am going to use my fingers just to touch something This is the alignment section, so I'm touching the left align, middle align, and right align. Another thing to notice is that the cursor develops a circle beneath it because you want to see where the cursor is. Now, if I put it back into mouse mode, that circle disappears. So I'm just going to do something real quick here. Put it back into touch mode. And I'll leave it in right aligned. And I'll just type something there. Jean Doe. Now I'll hold down. I'll select Jane Doe and I'll come back to my ribbon up here in the paragraph section and I'll just left align Jane Doe. If you want to become an expert at using Microsoft Word or just fairly familiar with it, feel free and subscribe to Microsoft Word tutorials only. This is only Microsoft Word tutorials and there are so many videos coming there's so much to learn also click the notification bell so that you could get an update each time there is an upload i'll see you in the next one bye bye now